Hello everybody, I'm Jimmy the Saint, and welcome back to 7 Days to Die. This is Alpha 16. Alright, welcome back, survivors. We are out here at the new location, um, where I'm starting to set up the new location anyways. I spent, um, it's day 16 now, I just ran back out here this morning. Started actually during the dark, while it was so dark outside, and ran out here. Got my sleeping bag set up out here, and I just got a couple of chests, and I just spent all, the, all of day 14 just moving stuff out here. Getting everything set up, just kind of throwing all my junk in here. In fact, I need to throw some of this stuff in here now. Um, anyways, so I spent day 14 doing that. Day 15, part of that day too, I was moving. And then uh, day 15, most of the day I spent working on the new base, which I'm going to show to you guys here in just a second. I was grabbing some some of the last little remnants out of the... Uh, out of the old base there and bringing them out here. Paper does not go in that container. Paper goes over here. Just trying to keep things sorted a little bit for now. Got my cooking utensils. I got to set up a cooking pot and thing, uh, or a campfire and things like that today. I just want to need to get going today. Um, cotton sh technically should not go in there. Uh, put it in here. There we go. Um, so yeah, I've been making uh, flagstone or co I mean cobblestone and turning that into flagstone blocks and starting my base. I spent I got to spend a little bit of time working on it um, yesterday before it got dark on me. I had to run back. Basically, all I did was dig it out to where I'm going to lay in everything. Um, got a few of the frames laid out. Let me see if you can see it better with night vision on. You might be able to see it a little bit better this way. Still kind of a little dark in the mornings here. But anyways, um, I've dug up, dug, dug everything out with the outline of the base where it's going to be. Um, it's kind of going to be a, I don't know, what would you call this, a... This diamond shaped uh, base here, a diamond shape. Anyways, I got to go in and finish digging all this out. I think I've got everything dug out now. I think I just need to lay in all my f flagstone for the floor. I thought I heard a zombie. Uh, <laughs> got to lay in all my flagstone, pick up all my little wood frames that I had laid to just kind of mark everything out along the edges. And I, and now I'm going back and placing the. Uh, flagstone in, which is going to be, you know, much more durable material, much stronger base. Um, I have not dug this side out entirely. I do hear a zombie. I hear a couple of zombies. Oh, I got a bunch of them over here. Oh, crap. Watch out. <laughs> Alright, we got to kill a few zombies before we can get to work. I don't want to keep getting distracted while I'm working here. That was a headshot. Nice, nice. There's another one. Oh, oh, I just missed him. I just went over his head. Got him. Alright, I think there's one more I heard. Where did where did she go? Look at that guy. He had some cash on him. 47 bucks. There she is. Is that Nurse Jessica? Nurse Jessica, where are you going? Come here. Hope, have a beaker on you, I hope. <laughs> what do you got? You got band-aids? Beakers? Come on. Something. Ugh. Nothing. Okay. Alright, back to work over here then. I gotta dig. Let's see. I need to dig. This side needs to be finished dug out. That side needs to be finished dug out. And we're gonna start laying in all the uh, cobblestone. Or, yeah, co flagstone to replace all the uh, frames and dirt and everything. Let's get to work on it.
Alright, there we go. There's uh, the outer walls. Just in time for the airdrop today. I wasn't really planning on going after that because I need to work on this base. But uh, let's give it a shot. It's not that far away. We'll give it a try. Hopefully we can get to it. Um, doesn't look that far away. but it, We'll find out here in a second if uh, it's further than it looks. Sometimes as you get up closer, it's like, oh, wow, I really still have a long ways to go. And it's across the body of water, so we may not be able to get to that. It's across that lake. Looks like it's going to land on the other side of the lake on that hill. Uh, we'll give it a shot. We'll see if we can get out here towards it. All right, it is landing just on the other side of the water. Is landing like right now. It may actually be in the water. That may actually, I think that's in the water. That'll be easy to get to because they usually float when they're on the water. The smoke is still up, so. Oh crap! Was that a. Oh, I thought it was a bear. <laughs> it was a boar. <laughs> Scared the crap out of me. Oh. Alright. Over this hill, I should be able to find. Not a wolf! Come on! That's the last thing I need right now. I'm out of stamina. Oh god, I'm gonna get killed out here. Oh, there's a cave out here, it looks like. Yep. Leave me alone, wolf! Oh! Oh, I'm bleeding, 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 bleeding! Heal! Oh, 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 that was close. Well, there is a cave out here. Oh, somebody's like blocked it off with spikes and stuff. Cool. I'm gonna come back to check for that. I gotta find this airdrop. I got turned around by this stupid wolf. Where is it now? Oh, do they not float anymore in the water? Oh, and then there's some a-hole in a motorcycle down, down my street. <laughs> oh, wow. Uh, so it didn't land over here on this side. It's in the water. Oh, and they don't float anymore. If it's in that lake, if it went underwater, I'll never be able to find it underwater. I thought they floated. Is that it? We'll catch some air. I think that's it. That's so far underwater, we'll probably drown trying to get this. I gotta try though, right? Yeah, you sink way, way, way too slow. That is not it. That's just some weird night vision. Yeah. That's not it. Okay. I do not see it on the bottom of the water. I don't see it floating on the water. That wolf really messed me up. Like, I was looking in the right direction. Oh, man. Alright. Oh, gosh, and I got a wandering horde. Oh, great. <laughs> I gotta avoid that. I can't find him in the water. Oh, I would be interested to see how they what they look like underwater, though. Just uh, running along on the bottom of the water. Just running along the bottom of the lake there, zombies. Having a good time swimming in the water. Zombie lake. Alright, well, if I, I'll give it a look right here on the ground. I could have sworn they, they, the airdrop still floated when they hit water, so it must not be in the water because I don't see it floating. So I'm going to run around here on the land for a second and see if I can spot it. All right, check it out, guys. This is that cave. Uh, no luck finding the airdrop. Uh, you know, I walked around for a while, could not spot it. But here, oh god, there's zombies in here. They're sleeping. They're sleeping. I can climb over the door instead of actually knocking down the door. I thought that would be easier. I didn't consider that there'd be a bunch of sleeping zombies in here. So we got to be extra careful. Grab these mushrooms in here. With any luck, we can. Uh, Sneak shot him and kill him. Let's see, is there anything worth looting in here, though? There's a zombie. Oh, crap, he didn't die. I'm stuck down here with a zombie. No way to escape. Oh, that was a big one, that's why. There we go. Um, Level up. Ding! Nice, level 30. Cool. Oh, what is with these stupid crates not having anything in them anymore? I, you know, I've been trained and conditioned playing this game for so many years to hit the crates because they've got good loot in it. That's where the good loot's at. But no, not anymore. Now they're full of junk. I wonder why they changed it. I wonder if, like, even if you go into, like, the, the stores, will it still have that? Oh, what was that? What was that? A yucca seed. Oh, okay, a seed. 
Hmm. Well, I'll try a couple more of these. Yeah, I mean, a box. Ooh. <laughs> a gun store box. Now, did they... Wait a minute. A gun store box. So, did they change... I don't know. They changed it. Whatever. Check this last one over here. A gun store box. Now, well, it had guns in it. Ah, okay. So, they just changed the way they look, I guess. Um, I definitely want those gun parts. Those are pretty good. Let's see. What have I got to drop here? Uh, old, old sham sandwich. You're going there, shammy sham. And a candy tin. I could scrap, but I don't have space. Gas can. I've read that already, haven't we? Yeah, so scrap that. Scrap the paper. There we go. And, oh, trash right here. Here we go. Hmm. Oil, dirt, I don't really need. I can get dirt all day long by digging it up. Dirt is free in this game. <laughs> um, anything else? Just quickly look around here in this cave. Grab all the mushrooms. Yeah, that's everything here. So this is pretty much like this other cave. It just got a, it, the, the cave over by the old base. It's just got a different entrance to it. Um, now can I get back out of here? <laughs> I gotta break my way back out. Let's see, do I have a my pickaxe? Uh, this is gonna be a pain. Let's get out of here. Let's get back to the base and get back to work on things. Gotta finish this base up. All right, that should give you a pretty good idea of what I'm working here on the base, what I'm looking for. I want a 
flat, smooth face to the wall on the outside. Um, and I'm going to do the same thing on the inside eventually when I get around to the inside. i got to finish the outside and at least have something put up for the night. It is getting pretty late, though. I'm almost done with the outside. At least for now, it's, it, it is going to be it's going to have to be a little bit taller than this. But for now, this is going to work. This is going to get us by for, the night or, for a night or two. Uh, if you haven't already, guys, please subscribe to the channel. Hit the thumbs up button if you like this video. Post me any comments or questions down below. Hey, we'll see you on the next one. Thank you so much for watching.